Hello, dear brothers and sisters, and we're from Peace and Love. This is your sister, Reverend Melissa, with a very brief message. I am back stateside. Hurrah! Glad to be back home on USA soil. The past three and a half years has been an adventure, one that I must say that I do not plan to retake again no time soon. So, um, to not delay my um, recommendations as far as your readings for uh, this upcoming week, although very few of you truly take counsel because if you did, then the Ancient Wars series would be more popular than it is, but I am so elated and happy to see that many of you are discovering the hidden truths and the wonderful teachings in the first and second books of Enoch. Um, I would certainly uh, even be more more joyous if you would do the same with the Gospel of the Holy Twelve. Um, the Gospel of the Holy Twelve, the Gospel of Peace, you cannot truly uh, seek wisdom without having read those as well. And Please do not send me no hate mail, no hateful comments, okay? Because I do recommend the Book of Mormon also. So don't hate on me because I'm LDS, alright? <laughs> there we are to love everyone. And in the kingdom of Yehovah, it does not matter your church affiliation for the most part as long as you follow the righteous ones and his teaching and you love thy neighbor as thyself so that means your muslim neighbor your jehovah witness neighbor your latter-day saint neighbor your baptist neighbor <laughs> we are to love everyone so on that note check out the book of mormon you know the church of jesus christ of latter-day saints it has been not easy over the Decades, but the church is not what it was in olden days. The church is multicultural, uh, multi ethnic, and just a place that is full of love. And surely, come on now, who can say that they have overdosed of love and that you don't need any of that? Give me all the love that you have to send to me. Listen, I've been away for a long time, so send me love. Just send me lots of love, okay? So, my recommendations for reading are two books, okay? No Hateful Comments, The Book of Mosiah from the Book of Mormon. And also, The Gospel of Peace. Because it's in the gospel of peace that you learn about the angels. You know, come on now. Look at everything that has happened in the world recently. We wonder mysteriously, how are these things able to happen? How are they able to be corrected? Because man's not going and filling up the holes that were created by man in the earth. The massive holes, the damage from the earthquakes, and yet you go to sleep, and then overnight, the the earth that was destroyed, all of a sudden you see uh, plant sprouts starting to come up again. The water that was made filthy suddenly is becoming clean. Do you think man is doing all those things? No, they're the holy angels. <laughs> Come on, let's give them thanks. We are so grateful. We are so blessed to live on this beautiful planet to have the holy angels that are always forever working so that we are cared for. And let's be kind and gentle with the animals. You know, um, there's so many. If one or two, you have one or two, and then your personalities don't match, then find a home from those two, and then go out and get another two. 
you know, there's always one that will work. If not, if they, if one does not work for you, that one may not have been meant for you. It was meant for someone else. So find that one a good home and then go out and provide a home for a new one. It's not hard. So anyway, I will not be preaching. I love you. I bless you all. I hope that you all are well and that you are provided for. And send me a note just to say hi. And discover the Ancient Word series today. You'll be glad that you did. Until my next video, take care and peace be with you.